Hey guys and welcome back to another wood brew video. In this week's video we are continuing the fan build by making some really cool leather storage solutions for the van with our good friend Lynn. She has an amazing channel so check the link in the description below to check out her channel. We're going to be working on a solution for your van today right? Right. Yes we need some storage solutions desperately because the van is so small. And I think leather makes everything cooler. Me too. Oh yeah. We've, yeah been, definitely. we've been desperate to try working like with leather. Like wood so. and leather. It's a great Perfect. combination. <laughs> so yes, I think your van needs some leather. So. <laughs> Lynn had an awesome idea to make a leather storage system for the wall of the van. First, we are going to cut out two long strips of leather that are three quarter inches wide and 30 inches long. Next, we want to make a zigzag pattern out of leather to go all the way down the two strips. So to make sure all the angles were the same, she used a sliding T-bevel and matched the pieces as she went along. These pieces are 3 quarter inches wide as well and 8 inches long. To attach each piece where they intersect, she used silver rivets to go along with all other hardware we have in the van. First, using a drive punch to create the holes for the two pieces of each side of the snap to connect to. Then with a setter and a plate, she could connect the two pieces to finish off an intersection. Then repeating those steps for all the others. After all the rivets were put in place, we can attach to the van using screws, making sure the leather is taut. While Dylan installs the leather system, I want to talk to you guys about this week's sponsor. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of classes in design, business, sewing, photography, even leatherworking, along with so much more. Premium memberships gives you unlimited access to high quality classes from experts working in their fields so you can improve your skills, unlock new opportunities, and do the work you love. We have really been enjoying LA Lum. Her classes give you an overview of the machine, how to work with heavy materials, and how to draft and make your own patterns. It's just what we needed to help us get started. Skillshare is also more affordable than most learning platforms out there. An annual subscription is less than $10 a month. Skillshare is hooking you guys up with two months free for the first 500 people who sign up through the link in the description. Thank you Skillshare for sponsoring this week's video and now back to your regular scheduled programming. Didn't it turn out really cool? I think it turned out really yes. cool. Really cool. It's super functional. You can put so much, <laughs> you can put so much stuff, so much on stuff in it. <laughs> you can put a shoe. A shoe. <laughs> a water bottle. One shoe or two? Two shoes. Two. Two shoes. You should be able to fit two shoes. I think I can roll a towel up. Thin. I roll a towel, a magazine, mm -hmm. if you have such a thing anymore. <laughs> what if we do, actually? Hang things from it. Hang yeah. things from, exactly. Hook things. The possibilities are endless, guys. Mm -hmm. In addition to the storage system, we wanted to make some leather straps for our curtains we sewed. These will be tie back so we can roll up our curtains during the day and let them down at night. Having the whole combination of leather, wood, and fabric is pretty much aesthetic goals if you ask us. Out of a long piece of leather, Lynn cut it down to an inch in width and we needed four pieces at around six inches each. Once that was done, I added a neat design just cutting off the corners of the ends to dress them up a bit. After that, we can start putting in our snaps, doing the same exact process as before. Next, we added the straps to some fabric from the craft store and added blackout fabric to the side facing the window to create our curtains. We sewed them in a coffee shop, so that wasn't strange or anything. And then we could attach them above the window. This spot on the wall was the absolute perfect spot to attach to. We pre-drilled through the fabric and leather first, which made it a lot easier to screw into the wood and not all at once. 
And now we have our curtains. Huge thanks to Lynn for letting us do some projects with her. We made an awesome leather lantern on her channel for the van as well. Link to that will be in the description. We are so happy with how both of these projects turned out. They look amazing. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this week's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to go check out Lynn's channel. There's a link in the description below. And be sure to check out last week's video where we collaborated with Johnny from Crafted Workshop to build a modular storage system for the van. See you guys in the next one. Mm. I'm a statue <laughs> smiling and waving. <laughs>